I'm in good health. Two Americans detained in North Korea say their health is okay and they are being treated well, but they are worried they may soon face trial. I am now requesting help from the American government, the citizens of America, and the world to release me from this situation. North Korean authorities allowed Matthew Todd Miller and Jeffrey Edward Fowle to meet a local Associated Press television news camera crew at an undisclosed location on Friday. The TV crew was permitted to ask questions, but it's not clear if the two Americans were speaking on their own initiative or if their comments were coerced. I apologize to the people the government of the United States as well as to the people in government of the DPRK. Jeffrey Fowle also produced a handwritten letter he said summarizes his experience in North Korea. My aim is to get that I message out to as many people hear it to help help us come home. The Americans that are held here, so that if somebody's unable to come to uh, Pyongyang, then they can get a get a copy of that and I'll understand a little bit of what's going on here. I need people's help. I need everybody's help that I can get. It's not known whether the letter was the Americans' idea or was written as a result of dialogue with the North Korean authorities. Fowl is suspected of leaving a Bible at a nightclub in the North Korean city of Chongjin. It's not known what specific crime Miller allegedly committed. North Korea's official news agency, KCNA, announced in April that Miller tore up his North Korean visa and shouted that he would seek asylum. Until now, North Korean authorities have not yet made public any details of any offense in connection with Fowl's detention. Salim Asaid, Associated Press.